afternoon. Buenas tardes. So who's still hungry? ¿Quién tiene hambre? <laughs> All right, who's still hungry for the word of God? ¿Quién tiene yeah. hambre del hambre de Dios? That's something we don't get too full on. Praise the Lord. Nunca nos llenamos, gracias a Dios. Um, before we get started, can Antes I just comenzar? Can I just have a show of hands if there's anybody that has not yet received a spot prize? Puedo decirme si alguien no ha recibido un Nice and high because I'm short and I just need to say Le nice and high. If you saber. have not yet received a spot si prize no and no premio, being shy, please come up because we have something favor, venga, for you. Algo para I, there was somebody back there. If someone's shy and you know they haven't gotten one and you're their neighbor, come up and get one si for them and then hand it to them. Hey, Angie, can you tap the air down just a little bit? Okay, and everybody as they came in, they should have gotten our last gift for you, which was a little magnet for your refrigerator. Y los so que entraron deben de haber recibido su último regalo, que era un, una cosa magnética para su refrigerador, un imán. So if you have not gotten one yet, just on your way out, please make sure you grab one. Si no han recibido uno en su camino hacia afuera, asegúrense que reciben uno. We're going to do something just kind of fun. I probably should have done it earlier because I know a couple ladies had to leave. But I want to take a picture of you guys all out there. So if, if you can, scoot in just a little bit. Lupita, do you want to you tell them and then hop down? Uh -huh. este, antes de que comencemos, vamos a hacer algo que me hubiera gustado hacer más temprano, que es tomar una foto. So si gustan, por favor, acercarse para tomarles una fotografía. Actually, I'll do a pano shot so I can get everybody in. So we're just a few more people are coming in. But we're going to go ahead and take the picture, and I'm going to make Lapita get down into the picture. I've been having so much fun. It's kind of sad that we're coming towards the end of our weekend together. But, you know, God is good, and there's just so much to chew on, even as we leave here later today. I'm just excited by everything that God's been doing in your lives. I th I thought that. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Me he divertido mucho. It's okay. Me he divertido mucho. I'm just going to paraphrase. <laughs> Me he divertido mucho y a pesar de que ya estamos a punto de finalizar esta conferencia, pero he pasado un buen tiempo con ustedes cantando. Um, at this point, I just, I'm excited to get back in to God's presence and just to get into his word. So I'm, I'm just going to pray and invite the worship team to come back up. A este punto solamente quiero llegar a los pies del Señor y descansar en su palabra, así que ahorita voy a darle la bienvenida al equipo de alabanza que venga a dar. Dear Lord, you have been so wonderful to us this weekend. Mi Señor ha sido tan hermoso con nosotros este fin de semana. We have 
just been overwhelmed by your presence and your spirit. Estamos aquí con, con tu presencia y en tu espíritu. We have been filled up. Nos has llenado. And God, right now, we just ask that you overflow us. Be here in this place. En este lugar. And continue just to meet and dwell with us. Y continúa llenándonos. In Jesus' name. En el nombre de Jesús. Amen. Amen.
together. nothing worth more that will ever come close nothing can compare you're a living home your 
Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit.
God, we thank you for being a good father. Thank you for receiving our worship. Thank you that you dwell the praises. You inhabit the praises of your people. And we can be in your presence. Thank you that we can join the angels around the throne who are constantly praising you. And we get to be part of that. So we thank you for that. Thank you, Jesus, for making the way to the Father. Thank you, Jesus, for the cross, for your precious blood, for your life. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We love you and praise you. Amen. Amen. Wow, that was nice, huh? Oh, yeah. You know, somebody said once that worship. Oh, should I wait for you? You. Alguien dijo una vez que la alabanza is the primary way of unselfing ourselves. Isn't that good? And that's exactly the way I felt. Like I, I, right now, I just feel so unselfed. <laughs> okay, uh, let's pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for Andrea and her beautiful gift and the worship team. We come to you now, Lord. Venimos ante ti, Señor. With our last session. En nuestra última sesión. We welcome you here. Te damos la bienvenida aquí, Señor. Do what only you can do, I pray. Haz solo lo que tú sabes hacer, Señor. In Jesus' name. En el nombre de Jesús. Amen. Amen. I wanted to, I, I love, love, love. A mí me encanta, <laughs> me encanta, me encanta. <laughs> Women's ministry. <laughs> yeah. I think women are amazing. Oh, yeah. I am. There's a big joke at our church. Because the women's retreat are like ridiculously way better than the men's. <laughs> <laughs> and so I just wanted to share um, my favorite girlfriend quote with you. A friend is one. Una amiga es una. To whom one may pour out. Alguien con quien se puede desahogar. The contents of one's heart. El contenido del corazón. Chaff and grain together. Chaff and grain. Chaff and grain. Yeah. Like the wheat and the chaff. Granos. Together. Juntos. <laughs> Knowing that the gentle hands. Sabiendo que sus manos nobles. Will take and sift it. Suaves las van a tomar y las van a colar. Keep what is worth keeping. Y van a mantener lo que, lo que vale la pena mantener. And with the breath of kindness, y con un aliento de bondad, blow the rest away. Van a sacar lo demás del camino. Isn't that precious? ¿No es algo bonito? That's what girlfriends are for. Eso es lo que las amigas hacen. It has been my pleasure ha sido un placer, uh, to share this journey through Psalm 51 with you this weekend. El compartir este, este caminar por medio del Salmo 51 con ustedes este fin de semana. I feel so at home here. Me siento como en casa aquí. <laughs> and I wanted to let you know y quería hacerles saber that several of you asked me for a copy que varias de ustedes me pidieron una copia of my poem, The House. De mi poema, La Casa. So I made copies Así que hice copias at the resource table. Y están en la mesa de recursos. Uh, the song that Andrea sang earlier 
la canción que Andrea cantó hace un momento resonated with my soul and with the message God gave me se quedó dentro de mi alma y con el mensaje que Dios me dio for this weekend para este fin de semana free of all her guilt es libre de toda la culpa rid of all her shame que se quite de toda la vergüenza and known by her true name y que sea conocida por su verdadero nombre and I I've been meditating on those words. Y he estado meditando en esas palabras. And the Lord gave me Isaiah 62, 3 through 4. Y el Señor me dio Isaías 62. Isaiah 62, 3 through 4. Del 3 al 4, 3 y 4. You will be called by a new name. Tú serás llamada con un nuevo nombre. You will be a crown of beauty in the hands of the Lord. Vas a ser una corona de belleza. A royal diadem. A royal diadem. Y vas a ser una cosa valiosa. In the hand of God. En las manos de Dios. It will no longer be said of you. No se va a decir de ti más. Forsaken. Que eres olvidada. Desolate. Que eres desolada. But you will be called. Pero vas a ser llamada. My delight is in her. Mi gozo está en ella. His delight is in you. Su delicia de él está en ti. He loves you more than you could ever know. Él te ama más de lo que tú puedes imaginar. And you are the apple of his eye. Y eres la manzana de sus ojos. No matter what you've gone through. No importa por lo que tú has pasado. No matter how difficult your life is at this very moment. No importa qué tan difícil esté tu vida en este momento. Take it from an older woman. Tómalo de una mujer más anciana. He can be trusted. Él puede ser confiado. Amen. Amen. You older girls. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so we've walked through Psalm 51. Así que caminamos por el Salmo 51. And we learned that God's mercy was in David's truthfulness Friday night. Y aprendimos el viernes que el, la verdad de David estaba en la verdad de Dios. As David prayed, cleanse me. Cuando David oraba y decía, limpiame. And then this morning, we realized that God's joy was in David's restoration. Y hoy en la mañana nos dimos cuenta que el gozo de David estaba en la restauración de Dios. And David prayed, restore me. Y David oró y dijo, restaurame. And so now at our last session, y ahora en nuestra última sesión, we're going to see that God's sacrifice is vamos, David's brokenness. Vamos a ver que el sacrificio hacia Dios es el quebrantamiento de David. And we, oh, wait a minute. And we're going to learn God use me. Y vamos a aprender Dios úsame. So turn to page eight in your book. We're going to look at 13 through 19 as we learn that God prayed, or David prayed, use me. Then I will teach transgressors your ways, and sinners will be converted to you. Dice, entonces enseñaré a los transgresores tus caminos, y los pecadores se convertirán a ti. Deliver me from blood guiltiness. Déjame de la sangre culpable. O oh God, the God of my salvation. Oh Dios, el Dios de mi salvación. Then my tongue will joyfully sing. Entonces mi lengua cantará alegremente. Of your righteousness. De su justicia. Oh Lord, open my lips. Señor, abre mis labios. That my mouth may declare your praise. Para que mi boca anuncie tu alabanza. For you do not delight in sacrifice. Porque tú no te deleitas en el sacrificio. Otherwise I would give it. De lo contrario, yo te lo daría. You're not pleased with burnt offerings. No estás satisfecho con ofrenda quemada. The sacrifice of God Los sacrificios de Dios are a broken spirit, es un espíritu quebrantado, a broken and contrite heart. Un corazón quebrantado y contrito. Oh God, you will not despise. Oh, Dios no despreciarás. By your favor, do good to Zion. Por tu favor, haz bien a Sion. Build the walls of Jerusalem. Edifica los muros de Jerusalén. Then you will delight in righteous sacrifices. Entonces te deleitarás en justos sacrificios. In burnt offering and whole offering. En ofrendas quemadas y en ofrendas quemadas enteras. 
and then young bulls will be offered on your altar. Y entonces se ofrecerán toros jóvenes en tu altar. So the last three things I see in Psalm 51 so las últimas tres cosas que veo en el Salmo 51 is David says, then I will teach other years, to others your ways. En, que dice, y entonces yo les enseñaré a otros tus caminos. And then I will sing of your righteousness. Y voy a cantar de tu misericordia. And I realize the sacrifice you want y me doy cuenta que el sacrificio que tú quieres is a broken and contrite heart. Es un corazón quebrantado y contrito. David said if God would cleanse him and restore him, he would teach sinners about the forgiveness of God. Da David dijo que si Dios lo limpiara y lo restaurara, entonces él le iba a enseñar a los pecadores acerca del perdón que Dios le da. And begin to sing of God's righteousness. Y va a comenzar a cantar acerca de la justicia de Dios. He said that it begins with brokenness. Dijo que comienza con quebrantamiento. And brokenness is the greatest sacrifice we can ever offer God. Y el quebrantamiento es el sacrificio más grande que, que podemos ofrecer a Dios. I've learned over the past 40 years He aprendido por los pasados 40 años that my emptiness determines my filling. Que mi, que mi vacío determina mi llenura. As I surrender my life to Jesus cuando yo le rindo mi vida a Cristo and let go of my own plans y yo voy con mis propios planes and trust him right where he has me y yo lo confío exactamente donde él me tiene he's able to fill me with his spirit él me puede llenar con el espíritu and give me the courage y me da el ánimo and strength to walk whatever is in front of me y la fuerza para caminar por lo que está enfrente de mí the more we hunger and thirst for righteousness entre más hambre tenemos de la justicia the more we will be filled. Amen? Lo más que vamos a ser llamados. Amen? The message of this psalm is that there is no sin El mensaje de este canto es que no hay pecado. or combination of sins o combinación de pecado. that can separate you from the love of God. Que puede del amor de Dios. That anyone can appeal to God for forgiveness. Que cualquiera puede venir y apelar a Dios por, por perdón. For moral restoration por restauración moral for the ability to resume a joy filled life por la habilidad de resumir una vida llena de gozo of fellowship and service de tener compañerismo y servicio if they come to god si vienen a dios in brokenness and receive god's grace y reciben la gracia de dios and forgiveness y su perdón david went on to live a god blessed life David si continuó a vivir una vida llena de bendiciones after the murder and adultery después del asesinato y el adulterio because he believed that God porque él creyó que Dios was big enough to forgive era lo suficientemente grande para perdonar and God is big enough to forgive anything y Dios es suficientemente grande para perdonar cualquier cosa in your life as well en su vida de ustedes también So verse 13 says, then I will teach transgressors your ways. El versículo 13 dice, entonces yo les enseñaré a los transgresores tus caminos. And sinners will be converted. Y los pecadores se convertirán. There is nothing greater to learn in this life. No hay nada más grande que aprender en esta vida. Than the lesson of receiving God's forgiveness. Que la lección de recibir el perdón de Dios and offering it to others. Y ofreciéndoselo a otros. As I told you Friday night, Como les dije el viernes en la noche, I think it's the most important parenting thing we teach. Because all of our children will struggle. Porque todos nuestros hijos van a sufrir. But they need to know God's big enough. Pero tienen que saber que Dios es suficientemente grande. David prayed. David oró. God cleanse me. Dios Limpiame. God restore me. Dios restaurame. And then finally, y God final, use me. Dios úsame. We all long for purpose. Todos anhelamos tener un propósito. Bringing the love of Jesus. Traer el amor de Dios. Into our everyday world. En nuestra vida de todos los días. Will change everything. Va a cambiar todo. 
It will change how we relate to our boss. Va a cambiar cómo nos relacionamos con nuestro jefe. It changes how we treat our husbands. Cambia cómo vamos a tratar a nuestros esposos. It changes everything. Cambia todo. And we become a witness for Jesus. Y nos convertimos en testigos para Jesús. The second thing, la segunda cosa, in verse 14, en el verso 14, David said, then I will joyfully sing of your righteousness. Dice, y yo voy a cantar con gozo de tu justicia. Once we really receive the forgiveness of God, cuando realmente recibimos el perdón de Dios, we can be restored back podemos ser restaurados nuevamente into a right relationship with him a una relación correcta con él. Where there's nothing between him and us. Que ya no hay nada en medio de él y de nosotros. This creates a new song of worship in our hearts. Eso crea un nuevo un nuevo cántico de alabanza en nuestros corazones. And I don't think we can sing that song y yo no creo que podemos cantar esa canción without the difficulties of life. Sin las dificultades que trae la vida. But he has a beautiful new song Pero él tiene un cántico hermoso for each one of us to sing to the world. Para que nosotros podemos cantarlo al mundo. You're the only you he's got. Tú eres el único tú que él tiene. And he wants your song y él quiere que tú cantes of redemption, de redemption and healing de sanidad and restoration y de and forgiveness y perdón. To be sung to the world. Que sea cantado hacia el mundo. Psalm 43 says. Salmo 43 dice. He put a new song in my mouth. Él puso una, un cántico nuevo en mi boca. A song of praise to my God. Un cántico de alabanza a mi Dios. Many will see. Muchos van a ver. And fear. Y van a temer. And will trust in the name of the Lord. Y van a confiar en el nombre del Señor. Isaiah 42:10. Isaías 42. Says, "Sing to the Lord a new song." Dice, canten, canten un cántico nuevo al Señor. Sing His praise from the ends of the earth. Canten sus alabanzas desde los rincones de la tierra. So as we are restored, así que como Dios nos restaura, then we have this beautiful song. Entonces nosotros tenemos este that we can nuevo, sing to hurting people. Que podemos cantar para la gente que está dolida. Who are looking for hope. Que está buscando esperanza. And I'm going to give you another one of my poems, if you don't mind. otro de mis poemas, si no les molesta. This one's called My Life Sings. Y este es llamado Mi Vida Canta. <coughs> my life sings to those around me. Every verse comes from above. Keep going. Rooms are filled with heaven's music as my life reflects his love. Mi vida canta. Mi vida canta a los que me rodean. Cada verso viene del cielo. Los cuartos están llenos de melodía angelical cuando mi vida refleja su amor. There are little ones who see me watching every move I make. Singing right along beside me, taking every step I take. Hay pequeños que me ven, observan cada uno de mis movimientos, cantando al unisono conmigo, tomando cada paso que doy. Give to me a song of service. Season every line with grace. Write my life's song in contentment, giving faith. Its proper place. Dame una canción de servicio. Adorna cada línea con gracia. Escribe la canción de mi vida con alegría, dando al, a la fe el lugar que le pertenece. Does my song reflect God's kindness? Introduce them to the King. Set before them joy and mercy. Do they hear the song I sing? Refleja mi canto la bondad de mi Dios. Representa a mi Rey. Pon delante de ellos el gozo y misericordia. Escuchan ellos la canción que canto. I must sing of God's great patience. Sing the tune of joy-filled days. Hum a lullaby of goodness. So they'll know his thoughts, his ways. Debo cantar sobre la paciencia de Dios, 
cantar al tono de Dios lleno de gozo. Tararean una canción de bondad para que conozcan sus pensamientos y sus caminos. Guard my lips from slander and gossip. Shut the door of selfish pride. Sing to them the song of Jesus, so in him they will confide. Guarda mis labios del chisme y de la calumnia. Cierra la puerta del orgullo egoísta. Canta a ellos la canción de Cristo para que en él aprendan a confiar. So God has a song for each one of us to sing. Our Dios tiene un cántico para cada uno de nosotros para poderla cantar. Our redemption song. Es nuestra canción de redención. God loves us so much. Dios nos ama tanto. And he cares for us far more than we care for ourselves sometimes. Y él se preocupa tanto por nosotros, mucho más de lo que nosotros nos preocupamos muchas veces. Often we prefer to hide our sin. Muchas veces preferimos esconder nuestro pecado. But he takes great effort to unearth and uncover things. Pero él se esfuerza por quitarlo y por sacarlo y sacarlo al descubierto. That we would rather keep hidden. Que lo que nosotros quisiéramos mantener escondido. He knows that they are like heavy chains on our soul. Él sabe que son como cadenas pesadas en nuestra alma. Causing discouragement and depression. Lo cual nos causa un, uh, depresión. He brings his healing. Él trae su sanación. Into the deepest places of our soul. En los lugares más profundos de nuestra alma. To free us from the bondage. Para librarnos de esa cautividad. He was very faithful to David. Él fue muy fiel a, a David. He never gave up on him. Nunca se rindió. Always unearthing, always uncovering. Siempre sacando, siempre limpiando. So that he could bring the light of his truth and forgiveness. Para traer la luz de su verdad y su perdón. Into the darkest chapter of David's life. En el capítulo más oscuro de la vida de David. And nobody's life. Y en, en la vida de nadie should be defined by its worst chapter. Debe de ser definido por el Amen. Oscuro. Amen. There's none perfect, no, not one. No hay nadie perfecto, ni siquiera uno. We are all the same. Todos somos iguales. We all need forgiveness. Todos necesitamos perdón. One of my favorite quotes Una de mis, de mis, uh, frases favoritas is what grows in the dark es lo que crece en la oscuridad dies in the light Muere en la verdad. when we bring the light of truth Cuando traemos la ver, la luz de la verdad into our lives a nuestras vidas, we can be set free podemos ser liberados. Nehemiah 9.17 Nehemiah says you are a God of forgiveness Dice, Tú eres un Dios de perdón. gracious and abounding in loving kindness Gracioso. Y abundante en amor y en bondad. And you did not forsake them. Y no los olvidaste. And he will never forsake you either. Nunca te va a olvidar. 10:43. Hechos 10:43. Says everyone who believes in him. Es todo aquel que lo recibe, que le cree a él. Receives forgiveness for sins. Recibe el perdón de los pecados. It's a free gift. Es un regalo gratis. Acts 3:19. Hechos 3:19 says, therefore, repent and return Así que y so that your sins may be wiped away para que sus sean in order that the times of refreshing para que así de may come from the presence of the Lord. Para que de la de Dios. And so as we end this conference, así que esta I feel that there may still be some in here Yo siento que puede haber todavía gente aquí who haven't surrendered que no se ha and would like to. Y le so I'm going to ask Andrea to come up. Así que le voy a pedir a Andrea que venga. And I'm going to read one more poem. Y voy a a leer un poema más. It's called Sense His Presence in the Room. Siente su presencia en, en mi lugar. I will see him in the darkness. Lo voy a ver en la oscuridad. I will feel him in the gloom. Lo voy a sentir en, en lo triste. Though his special touch seems distant. Aunque su, su toque especial se siente distante. I'll sense his presence in the room. Yo siento su presencia en el cuarto. 
I will trust him without answers. Lo voy a Le voy a confiar aún sin respuestas. I will trust and wait and rest. Voy a confiar, esperar y descansar. Knowing that his ways are sovereign. Yo sabiendo que sus caminos son sólidos. And his ways are always best. Y que sus caminos son siempre mejores. He will fill my empty heartache. Él va a llenar mi corazón, el vacío de mi corazón. He will comfort all my pain. Él va a darme consuelo en todo mi dolor. Though the path seems dark and lonely. Y aunque el camino se vea oscuro y solitario. Trusting him will make it plain. El hecho de creer en él lo va a hacer plano. How unsearchable his judgments. Sus, sus, ju sus juicios son que no se pueden entender. How unfathomable his ways. Inimaginables son sus caminos. He is mighty in his power. Él es poderoso. And persistent through my days. Y persistente a través de mis días. Just bring all your thoughts to Jesus. Solo trae todos tus pensamientos a Jesús. Stop the madness. Silence doubt. Paren, paren todo el caos. Take your troubled soul to Jesus. Take, lleven su alma a, con problemas a Jesús. For he knows what you're about. Porque él sabe de qué se trata. Let him drench your soul with patience. Déjenlo que inunde su alma de paciencia. Let him wash away your gloom. Dejen que él lave toda tristeza. Let him take away the anguish. Dejen que él arranque la angustia. Sense his presence in the room. Y sientan su presencia en este lugar. And I know I've said some hard things. Y yo sé que he dicho cosas difíciles. This weekend. Este fin de semana. And I know that some of you are going back to difficult situations. Y yo sé que algunas de ustedes van hacia unas situaciones difíciles. That nothing's changed. Que nada ha cambiado. The circumstances are still the same. Las circunstancias siguen siendo las mismas. But I pray. Pero le pido a Dios. That you have been cleansed. Que ustedes hayan sido limpiadas. That you have been restored. Que hayan sido restauradas. And that you will start singing that new song soon. Y comiencen a cantar ese cántico nuevo. And when I got saved. Y cuando yo fui salvada and surrendered my life to Jesus y le entregué mi vida a Cristo, I was too proud to go forward yo tenía mucho orgullo para ir adelante. and so I know there's some in this room that won't stand and it's okay y está bien. God loves you anyway de todas maneras, Dios te ama. and what I did was when I got home I got on my knees by my bed yo fui y me hinqué de rodillas a mi cama. And asked Jesus Christ into my heart. Y le pedí a Jesús que viniera a mi corazón. And surrendered my life to him. Y le entregué mi vida a él. And it worked. Y trabajó. So I'm going to ask Andrea if she will sing that song again. Holy Spirit, you are welcome here. nothing worth more will ever come close nothing can compare you're a living Lord your presence taste it Holy Spirit 
I'm going to give you one more chance. If you would like to feel that cleansing power of Jesus Christ, if you would like to be restored in pure fellowship with Jesus, so that he could use you to sing that new song, I'm going to ask you to stand right now in your seat where you are. One more chance. Praise God. Gracias. Father, we come to you and thank you. We worship you. We love you. Lord, cleanse us. Restore us. Use us, and then do it again tomorrow. Father, we need you. We surrender to you, Jesus. Bring purpose and meaning to our lives, Lord. Through the power of your Holy Spirit, I pray. And for those who have stood, Lord, I pray a special blessing. May they be filled with your Holy Spirit like never before. May you use their lives for your glory on earth. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let's all stand. Vamos a ponernos en Your love is devoted Like a ring of solid gold Like a vow that is tested Like a covenant of all And your love is enduring Through the winter rain And beyond the horizon With mercy for today Faithful you have been and faithful you will be you pledge yourself to me and 
That's why I sing your praise will ever be on my lips, ever be on my lips, your praise will ever be on my lips, ever be on my lips, your praise will ever be on my lips, ever be on my lips, your praise will ever be on my lips, ever be on my lips. And you father the orphan, and your kindness makes us whole. And you shoulder our weakness, and your strength becomes our own. And you're making me like you, you're clothing me in white, bringing beauty from ashes, for you will have your pride free of all her guilt and rid of all her shame known by her true name and that's why i sing your praise will ever be on ever be on my lips your praise will ever be on my lips ever be on my lips your praise will ever be on my lips Ever be on my lips, your praise will ever be on my lips. You will be praised, you will be praised. With angels and saints, we sing, Worthy are you, Lord. You will be praised, you will be praised. With angels and saints, sing worthy are you Lord and it's why I sing your praise will ever be on my lips or oh, ever be on my lips your praise will be But you have filled our hearts and our spirits. I know for myself, Jesus. Yo sé, Señor Jesús, por mí. I don't want to leave this place. No quiero dejar este lugar. But Lord God, I know that you can do a work in my life even as I walk through these doors. Pero yo sé que tú puedes hacer un trabajo a través de mi vida a pesar de que cruces las puertas. So God, may this just be the beginning. Y Dios, que este solo sea el comienzo of the work that you're doing in each one of these ladies' lives. Del trabajo que tú estás haciendo en cada una de las vidas de estas mujeres. Continue to fill us to overflowing. Sigue nos llenando, Señor. So we may pour out to those around us. Y que derrame para que así puedan darle a los demás. You are so amazing. Eres tan buen Dios. And we just fall at our feet and say thank you. Así que caemos a tus pies y te decimos gracias. In Jesus' name. En el nombre de Jesús. Amén.
before we head out and have our final tea break, because I know you guys are still hungry. <laughs> I just want to take a, a, a minute to thank just a few ladies. Obviously, we had an amazing team. Quiero tomar un minuto para darle gracias a algunas mujeres. Obviamente tenemos un equipo.